You're watching 18 News Today. And welcome back to 18 News Today. I'm here with Dell, George, and Tina Iron. How are the two of you doing this morning? Very good. Very good. Well, you guys have an exciting performance coming up. Tell me a little bit about that. Good. Well, our performance <laughs> coming up this weekend is Arsenic and Old Lace. Uh, we'll be performing this weekend and next weekend at the Clemens Center, Mandeville Hall. Mm -hmm. And how long have the two of you, as well as your cast, obviously, uh, how long has the preparation taken to get ready for this performance? Oh, we had we had auditions back in October, I think it was. So it's been several months we've been working oh, wow. on it. We're in tech week right now, so long nights rehearsing, trying to, to fix up every every detail, make it as good a performance as possible. Well, Dale, since we just heard from you, Tina, let's hear a little bit about what Arsenic and Old Lace is actually about. <laughs> uh, the story centers around the Brewster family. And it's basically a day in the life of the Brewster family, which blows up in everyone's face. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm one of two aunties, um, Aunt Martha. I have a sister, Abby. We live in the house with our brother, Teddy, who fashions himself to be Teddy Roosevelt. So we are an unusual family in that we, we're sort of holding on to old times. We live sort of in, in the Victorian era. Mm -hmm. um, we're kind, we're generous, we're caring, we're compassionate, and we have our oddities. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was going to say, our is the uh, family a little bit rowdy? Because I know Dale over here oh. is playing Officer O'Hara, and there's got to be a reason that there's oh. an officer in the no, production. No, they're, they're really sweet, but they <laughs> have kind of a secret that uh, that nobody knows about, and everybody thinks they're the best people in town. And and uh -oh. so the officers are actually just friends in the neighborhood and, and stop by. And luckily, they stop by at some sometimes the appropriate times to, to keep it from getting out of hand. <laughs> Well, speaking about that secret, without giving it away, obviously, yeah. what would you say to some of the uh, community members in the Twin Tiers, what would you say to them to make sure that they get out there and see this uh, oh, it's, production? It's, it's a great comedy. It's a, it's a classic, uh, classic comedy of just you know, things that, that, that go wrong, but uh, everybody seems to, to work it out in the end. It's got a love story in the background. It's, it's got quirky characters. It's, uh, it's a lot of fun. It's been a lot of fun doing the whole thing. I was going to say, it looks like it touches on everything. But I'll let you uh, finish up. I, I think the genius of this show is that uh, Mr. Kesserling, who wrote the, the show, um, is a black comedy. And it could be a very dark material. Mm -hmm. But uh, he uses lovable characters and laugh a minute actions that uh, just keep people. Wanting more. <laughs> well, that's going to be all the time we have. But Dale and okay. Tina, thank you so much for coming in this morning. We're going to be right back with more news and weather after the break.